Sure, I remember. I loved that. Remember Steady Alpha 5? Oh, yeah, I remember that. Oh, Mimi. Oh, Mimi. I remember that. of the Princess of Nepopolis, the greatest warrior to ever grace the Brescieri. Another came to challenge me. I came out victorious, but weakened. I must ingest a potion of healing so I can return to Nepopolis and caress my beloved. Can you help a guy out? Clear for takeoff. Oh, shit. Of course, this will work nicely. If you ever need help, call me and I shall fight by your side. Of course, a portrait with Nepopolis' greatest warrior. Our bond is sealed. Yep, that's my dad. Ready? Yeah! See you later, man! New kid, it's time to prove yourself. I've marked the location of the mission on your map. The other Freedom Files will be waiting for you. Okay, new kid, apparently Tweak and Craig have agreed to some counseling together. Okay. Could you meet us at the school? Thank you. Somebody call for a fast pass? New kid. Party's over, kid. We got you dead to rights. The vigilante's making a break for it. Kid, meet me the over right here. All right, kid, this is a very important mission. Are you sure you're up to it? Well, come on, let's go, Freedom Pals. We're here for the community service. Oh, wonderful, everyone! Some of the local children are here to sing for us. Right. Oh. Oh. Eh. Oh. I love to play my triangle, my triangle goes. 
When I am sad, I love to hear my triangle go. It cheers me up. And it makes me smile. You suck! We're sorry, folks. This kid's new. I love, I love to, to play, play my triangle, my triangle goes. Ooh. I love to play my mandolin, my mandolin goes. When I am sad, I love to hear my mandolin go. It cheers me up. And makes me smile. Get off the stage! Huh? I love to play my mandolin, my mandolin goes. I love to play my flugelhorn, my flugelhorn goes. I love to play my flugelhorn, my flugelhorn goes. When I am sad, I love to hear my flugelhorn go. It cheers me up. It's disgusting. And it makes me smile. Everybody, I'm shielded. Okay, bye. Okay, bye for now. Oh God, is it my turn? Supreme Thunder! Ow! <gasps> Nurse, get ready to call a cold blue. Angry letter to the paper about you kids. Oh, oh, that's quite enough. Which I enjoyed corporal punishment. So 
some respect for your elders. Ready to initiate temperament upgrades. I need my pills back! This kid's hopped up on something! Look out! Thank <laughs> you. 
I knew I should have gone to the little boy's room before we got started. Ow! You better not mess up my bingo hand. Serve you right, jerk! This is Mysterion. We had some trouble, but the mission is complete. Nice work, everyone! New Kid, congratulations! You're officially a member of Freedom Pals. You can join us tonight on our mission to the police station. We've ascertained that the police are being paid off by whoever's running crime in the city. That's right. We believe we'll find the answers to what's going on there. Welcome to the team, friend. We'll see you tonight. Don't tell anyone we're going to the police station. Ha! Dude, that was awesome, New Kid! Attention all Coon friends! Report to the Coon Lair! We know now what the Freedom Pals know! All Coon friends to the Coon Lair! Great work, Butt Lord. I'm the f-fastest kid in town. There you go. <laughs> it is I, Professor Chaos. Um, I have kind of a problem, new kid. You know all those immigrant minions I hired? Well, I sort of can't pay them now because, you know, well, you kind of followed my plans, and so I didn't get paid, and, uh, well, I had some pretty pissed off minions. Can you meet me at the bank? I'd really appreciate it. Chaos out!
new kid. The boys and I are in the gymnasium, okay, for some therapy exercises. Can you meet us there? Okay. Hey, new kid, come on in and have a seat. Okay, apparently we're having a little quarrel. Okay. Craig and Tweak have agreed to some counseling as long as you're present, new kid. Okay, so, uh, now, Craig, what do you, what do you want to say to Tweak? I think he has some stuff he should say to me. Okay, okay, Tweak, you want to start, maybe? I have nothing to say if that's his attitude. Okay, okay, well, maybe, uh, new kid, maybe you should share some of your thoughts. Okay, well, this isn't really going that well, um... Okay, boys, I want to do an exercise with you. Uh, I have some kids here to help us out. When we're trying to have some therapy, the first thing we need to do is is take out our resentments, okay? So, uh, let, let's have our resentments come out. Come on out over, come over, resentment. Okay, and then, in any relationship, we also have expectations, okay? Because expectations lead to resentment, which, of course, brings about accusations. Come on out, accusations, okay? And then that all, of course, leads to victimization and withdrawal. Now, you've got to learn to overcome all of these things, okay? Are you ready? Are you ready? Go fuck them up! There they are, right there, Tweak and Craig. Go, go beat the shit out of them! You too, new kid! Let's dance. I mean, not literally, because I don't dance. Let's, let's punch. Go nuts, new kid. Okay, Thunder Geek. Make it this much. Oof. That'll teach expectations for being unrealistic. The storm coming! Bring down the lightning! Oof. Oof. We get it, you have weather control powers. Don't have to make such a production out of it. Uh, yes, I do! You think it's easy to huh? the weather? Crap, no one likes victimization. Expectations doesn't go down that easy. There's always more expectations. You boys have to work together if you're gonna eliminate all of those expectations, okay? Wait, he's right. Huh? We're only going to get rid of these expectations and everything else if we do it together. Okay. 
I get this, punch a rule. You like that withdrawal? You gonna cry now? Ha! Ow! And how do you respond to withdrawal when he's clearly emotionally unavailable? I was gonna hit him. Listen to your instincts on this one, okay? Okay, now normally responding to withdrawal with chill might actually make things worse, but in this case, I like it. <laughs> the weather's about to turn! Here comes a shot! <laughs> You'll be feeling that for a while! My turn. Mega Pump Push! Get up, new kid. We beat them without you. Don't you feel better? Yeah, I kinda do. Me too. Okay, we'll just come back anytime you need counseling, okay? That's, uh, that's it. Thanks for all your help, new kid. Yeah, fuck you, expectations. Thanks, new kid. We have a lot of work to do, but I think we both want to do it now. Come on, Craig. I'll get you your laptop. It's our laptop, Tweak. <laughs> Need to get somewhere... Fast, you kid. See you, new kid. Your precious global financial system is in flames. <laughs> Kid. All right, so this is the person you wish to have co-signed for you? Oh, that's correct. Uh, see, I hired a bunch of minions to help me destroy the town. Uh, but my plan didn't actually come to fruition, so I'm unable to pay the minions at this time. All right, well, what we can do is set up an LLC for you, which we can use to fund a money market account co-signed by your friend here, whose house we can put a lien on to an overseas investment, and it's gone! What's gone? Your friend's house. It's gone. Owned by a company in Hong Kong now. Thank you. Have a nice day. But I just needed to pay my minions. I didn't mean to get my friend's house taken away. Yeah, you're not too good at this economic stuff, huh? Perhaps your friend should play. Yeah, you play, new kid. Round and round she goes. Where she stops, nobody knows. All right, kid, try your luck. Round she goes. Where she stops, only a random number generator knows. Hit your class advancement goal and rise to the next economic level, but go bankrupt, your level will drop. Oh, here it goes, what's gonna happen? Soybean futures. Agile investing bonus. Triple value on the next spot you land on. We got a bonus in play. And you've done it! Woo! Winner, winner, chicken dinner. These children just got a loan for over $80,000 to pay immigrant workers their salaries. You can be a winner too. Just keep on trying, people. Here's your check, kid. Gee whiz, thanks a lot, new kid. You're really good at this. Well, come on, we gotta get this to the mini.
There they are! Those are those damn kids that paid immigrant workers! Yeah, they got a loan to pay their minions, so you know what that means? They took our job! They took our job! They took your job! Wait a minute! I thought we were mad because of their gender choice and sexuality and stuff. No, that's of those other guys. We just want our jobs back. Oh, well, let's get your jobs and make fun of them for their former self-identification. Come on, boys. Let's show them some minions made in America. Speaking of minions... Our minion job. He took our marriage. Este día es muy weird. I'm gonna bounce your ass like my chicks. Microaggression. Hit him. Be careful, you don't look so hot. Car! Come on, move! I have a thing to get to. America, love it or get your ass kicked, socialist. This stuff's scary, huh, butthole? Uh, ow! This work is muy horrible. It is I, Wonder Tweak! Well, gosh, I feel 
bad I don't have enough minion drops for those fellas. But thanks again, new kid. Who knows? Maybe we'll start our own Legion of Evil super villains one day. That'd be pretty sweet, huh? Bye! Need to get somewhere f f f f f f quickly. Just get good going, new kid. There you go. No, girls allowed. Here's Butt Lord now. Great job, hero. Those freedom posers have no idea you fucked them over. All right, guys, listen up. Butt Lord has discovered that the freedom pals are infiltrating the police station tonight. We have to get there before they do. The police station? We can't take down the police, are you crazy? Yeah, just let the freedom pals go do it. We can't do that, guys. Why not? Because at approximately 10.30 a.m. this morning, Classy was arrested by the police. How do you know? We have to help her, fellas. We made a promise. If we let Freedom Pals go do this on their own, then we're the douchebag franchise they say we are. But why would Freedom Pals work with us? Don't forget the new kid is all buddy-buddy with Freedom Pals now. But Lord can trick them into an assault on the lower level of the police station, and meanwhile we'll sneak in and bust Classy out. We're probably gonna get the Freedom Pals killed. And then whose superhero franchise would be number one? We did make a promise to Classy. Everyone get home and get to bed. We have a big job to do tonight. That'll be all, Butt Lord. Go home and wait to hear from the Freedom Pass. What? What do you want now? What? Again with the puppy eyes. Are you fucking kidding me right now? No, new kid, absolutely not. You cannot have another class. Look, I'm sorry about what happened to your mother. I know that you want closure, but... Oh. No, I guess I don't know how it feels. You're right. You're right. Maybe you should have just one more class. Plant Mancer. Perhaps a Plant Mancer, like Poison Ivy or Groot. You were laying in bed and you heard your mom screaming. You walked out into the hallway. What do you think of this, space boy? <laughs> As a plant mancer hero, you harness the powers of nature to protect, but also to attack. You couldn't stand to watch that innocent alien get bullied. It was time to give those thugs a taste of their own medicine. You conjured a sweet-smelling scent to charm one of the intruders. Wow, you smell like flowers. I'll do anything for you. Completely enamored, the intruder was at the mercy of your will. This guy bothering you? Hey, what are you doing? Take this! God, Jesus! How could you fight a child and an alien? Snap out of it, man! Ugh, huh? The blow from his comrade shook off your charm spell, but the confusion had bought the alien some time to recompose itself. She took out its space ray and opened fire on one of its attackers. You and the alien shared a glance. You could tell it trusted you. She reached to the ground so as to use Mother Nature's power to defeat the alien's attackers. Root sprung from the ground, dropping the alien bullies to the ground in a twisted wave of wood. Jesus, I'm out of here. Yeah, fuck your plants, kid. Your newfound alien friend breathed a sigh of relief. Move. But then a third intruder entered the hallway. Move. And he also wanted to beat up the alien, so he did. The vengeance. The alien couldn't take the beating sitting down, of course. It retaliated with another shot of its face ray. You can see the alien 
was fighting for dear life, so you summoned the gentler side of your plant powers to heal it. Continue to pummel your new space friend until it was unconscious. Ooh, ooh. Watching the alien fall sprouted something inside of you. You summoned all of your plant matter power to revive your fallen friend. Mother Nature heard your call and bestowed her bountiful gifts upon you and the alien. As is the nature of a support class, the glory of the final blow rarely falls on your shoulders. Move! Move! But you're always on the winning side. You ran to your parents' door, and before anything bad could happen, you ran inside to protect your mom! But you were too late, your dad totally fucked her. Oh, it must be tearing you apart inside. How people can do that to other people, I just, I'm, I'm so sorry. Anyway, we've got work to do tonight. I'll see you at the police station. There's nothing more to talk about. I'll be in touch tonight after your parents think you're sleeping. You stupid fucking cow! Have another glass of Chardonnay, why don't you? I have to drink to deal with you! That marijuana is changing you somehow! At least marijuana is natural, not like... grapes! You're fucking hot! Maybe so, but I'm not telling everyone our child's secrets! Go be paranoid some more in your room, Chris! Have another drink, Kelly! Go be paranoid some more in your room, have Chris! Have another drink, Kelly! Oh, hey, kiddo. Daddy's gonna go upstairs to his room. Mommy's gonna go get a drink. <laughs>
Sweetie, you forgot to eat your dinner. Mommy put it down on the table. Come on, honey. Gotta eat your supper. Did you put more of that stuff in our child's food? Shut your fucking mouth! How do we know that medicine doesn't have side effects, huh? You know her child needs the medicine as much as I do! Uh, you drunken whore! Fucking butthead! How dare you make our child choose sides! You put the medicine in his food, too! I'm not having anyone choose sides! Go on down and eat your supper, champ. Get dressed and meet me out front. Hurry, the night awaits. Cool room. 